Hey y'all, glad you could stop by and see me today. I have a short little tutorial on how to make the um, custom paper clips. I had a couple ladies ask me if I would show them how to do this, like the ones that I made in the Ladybug Mini. And um, y'all are gonna love how easy this is if you've never done them before. And you can use all sorts of things. This is one I did with buttons and just made a two-sided paper clip because the buttons were mirror image, so I was able to do that. And then this little um, butterfly, I actually um, tinted my paper clip with alcohol ink so it would match. And then I finished the back with some cardstock. And all you do is take whatever it is, you can use bling, buttons, charms, just anything, um, seashells. And you just, I just take matching cardstock, which I'm showing you with a contrasting color so you can see a little bit better. And I just lay it down and trace around it. Oops slip sliding away and once you have traced around it you just cut that out and once you cut it out you have the backing for your your paper clip it just gives it a little more finished look to it if you don't have something that is a mirror image you know if you didn't have another butterfly or just did not want to use two of them on the one clip and this is another one I made um, with a little mixer bowl and I actually used a brad that I broke the little arms off of to do that, which is the same thing I did with these little hearts. These were just big brads, and I just broke the little arms off, and I'm going to show you all how to do it, and you can use the hot glue, which is what I'm using, or E6000, or any firm holding glue, <clears throat> and um, all you do is put some hot glue on your little item, and Put your paper clip in it and be sure and put it the right end otherwise you won't be able to use the paper clip. I'm going to put just a little bit more and then you put your mirror item over the top and press that down. Make sure you've got it nice and even. And there you go. You've got your custom paper clip. And like I said, you can um, you can move it while it's warm, you know, before the, the glue dries and gets cold. But you can actually stain or dye your paper clips to match if you want to, if you don't want the, the regular silver color. And that way you can use just the real inexpensive office paper clips. And that's it. There's four to check it out. And I'm glad y'all joined me. I'll see you with the next video. Bye.